Hey kids, Lisa here with a very quick video just sharing um, my uh, trimming of this wild unknown um, knockoff um, edition that I got on eBay. Accidentally, I didn't. I wasn't seeking a knockoff edition, but once having uh, bought it, um, I realized it was a good um, a good thing to play with with trimming of the deck. Um, I wanted to have a version of the deck that was sort of a little bit smaller, um, just a little bit more handy, and here here she is. Um, so you've seen, I mean, there are other videos where people who are actually much more adept at trimming than I am, I'm kind of a klutz, you've, you've seen probably versions of this before, um, but I just wanted to share with you, um, again, I am a klutz, so I don't tend to do a great job with these things, but and it's hard to get it straight um, with the Wild Unknown because the, the borders are themselves um, hand-drawn. But, you know, it's sort of, and that actually, I should back up, that affects how well it shuffles. So um, this deck shuffled okay. Um, I don't know if you can hear that. I can't really. Um, it shuffled okay before. Now I actually have real problems with shuffling it um, because it's not evenly cut. But the cards themselves, you know, I've, I've been playing with these. The cards themselves, I think, look fabulous. Some of the cards that have the, um, the sort of cabochons in the corner, that, yeah, it works okay. Um, I've been really enjoying, um, this is a deck that, you know, I, 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 in the first and second editions and even in the third edition, the mass market, I, I just don't feel great carrying it around. But to have this trim version of the knockoff, yeah, I pop it in my bag and, um, and there you go. Um, I will say that immediately after I um, I trimmed it, I did a very quick um, just a card pull, and I was I was asking, you know, show me the card that speaks to my relationship with this deck, and I got the Nine of Swords, and um, I completely flipped out. Well, that's a slight exaggeration. I didn't completely flip out, but I was thinking, what the heck, it, you know. Um, is this deck, does this deck hate me? <laughs> does Kim Kranz hate me? Um, and so, you know, I did what one should probably never do, which is, um, I don't like that answer, give me another answer. Um, the next card I pulled was the Four of Wands. No, was it the Four of Wands? No, it was the Four of Discs. Um, it was the Four of Discs, which, here we go, it was the Four of Discs. Um, which I interpreted as saying, hold on, hold off. And then I breathed. I thought, you know, this deck is reflecting back my anxiety. Um, and I did another poll in which, and this, this is the card that keeps coming up for me, not with this deck per se, the Wild Unknown, but with this version of this deck, this knockoff. Um, I, I've been stalked repeatedly by the Son of Pentacles. Now, the Knight of Pentacles, the Knight of Discs, is not a card I resonate with. I, I, I just, there are certain people in my world, certain energies that I associate with this card, but the Son of Pentacles in this deck, and as it keeps coming up for me these days, these days, the past three days since I trimmed the deck, um, I feel this really deeply steadying influence. So, so what, what is there left to say? I think. Um, the trimming of this deck, I would, again, I would never do it. Um, this, by the way, I'm, I'm rambling, but I really don't like this devil card. In the comments below, are there people who resonate with this card? For me, this is, this is just a silly devil card. It's, I mean, I love this deck, but this, I, maybe I'll do a video on cards I hate in decks I love. Oh, that'd be a good video. Um. This just doesn't, I mean, 
a kind of cute looking goat with a pentagram on its forehead and its feet on fire. I don't know. Anyway, I think that this deck, I would never have trimmed it. Oh, the magician. I would never have trimmed a version of it that came from Kim Kranz. But there's something about there's something about the having the knockoff version, not knowing what to do with it, and thinking, ah, trim away. And um, having trimmed it, um, it feels like I've made a relationship with this particular version of this particular deck. Okay, um, my light is fading. Um, I'm pixelating all over the place. Much love to you all. Peace, harmony, bliss, unity. Um, Bye.